What's up? It's Slay Gaming here, and today we are playing Minecraft Story Mode. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. If you hear me like saying ow, it's because my neck really hurts. And let's begin this thing. Um, it fits me the best. Isn't there an orange Jesse? Or this? I'm the guy who can. So, I, all of these. Oh, I bought all of these. Wait. Yeah. Okay. A new Johnny in Minecraft Story Mode 2. Um. If you guys think, oh, well, what about Minecraft Story Mode 1? I'll get that soon. It's just we're starting with Minecraft Story Mode Season 2 because, well, I never bought Minecraft Story Mode 1. I always like stories where the hero has no idea that they're destined for greatness. The sort of heroes who are living their lives and assume that nothing will ever happen to them. Those are the kind of heroes they started as just a bunch of friends in a treehouse, looking up to their idols who had come before them. But when disaster struck and an evil monstrosity threatened to destroy the world, those friends discovered that heroes can come from the most humble of beginnings. They traveled the world to battle that monster, facing obstacles and sacrifices every step of the way. It wasn't easy. But they had each other, and working together, they struck it down and saved everyone. Soon, they were the most famous people in the whole world, and their legend, their fame, just continued to grow as they explored more worlds, venturing into the great unknown. And that's how those five friends, plus the bravest pig in the world, took their place in history as some of the greatest. It was great, Lucas. Although, not always technically accurate. Yeah, I mean, well, I definitely exaggerated here and there, but it was for the drama. I mean, it made us sound cool, and that's a good thing. <laughs> It's all fair game if it's helping you to tell a good story. It's not like you're lying to, like... See, that's Sorry exactly that. what I thought. If you're planning on including schematics, we should... Sorry about that one. I was just fixing something. ...should talk, though. I think I'm okay. I had been hoping to have it ready to read at Founding Day, but, uh... Next year. I can't believe it's Founding Day already. It sneaks up on me every time. Congrats, buddy. I'm proud of you for finishing it. That took a lot of work. I'm glad you liked it. You did so much, Jesse. You're a real hero. But we all did, right? Yeah, we were all there. For uh, most of it, anyway. That's true. Um... Oh, are you guys jealous? You guys jelly? Yeah, no! Jelly. Of course not. Hey, whoa, whoa, guys, come on. Well... This has all been really helpful feedback, guys. Once Ivor and Harper get back from their adventures, I can add a chapter about them, and then it will finally be done. Man, they've been gone a long time. Jesse, your intern. Jesse? Oh, hey, Radar. Oh, gosh, wow. I didn't know all of you would be in here. <laughs> Olivia, ma'am, Axel, sir, you, Lucas, sir. So sorry to interrupt everyone. Oh, he is just adorable. My deepest, sincerest, utmost apologies if I've caused any inconvenience. Radar, don't be so formal. Cut it out with all the sir and ma'am stuff. Right-o, right. Awesome. I kind of liked it. So, what's up? I got a message from Petra that she's on her way to the mines. For that adventure you scheduled, if you hurry, you should still have time for that and your founding day duties. Oh, nice. We should get going. Yeah, uh, about that. We've actually got our own Founding Day stuff we need to prep for? Yeah. This is a little loud. Uh, 
Uh, I need to get back to Boomtown. I'm judging a TNT rally in the morning. Oh, that's okay. I get it. You have your life, and so do I. Ah, <sighs> thanks, Jesse. Yeah, thanks. Petra will never let you hear the end of it, though. Tell Petra I said next time for sure, okay? I can't wait to see how that sword of hers is coming along. Yeah, I'll tell her. I can't believe I'm walking out of the Order Hall with the Order. <laughs> oh, so freaking cute. So the other towns have founding day celebrations, huh? Yeah, man. We honor Magnus every year with a freaking awesome memorial explosion rally. He would have loved it. Over in Redstonia, we're a little lighter on the explosions. I helped Eligard engineer an excellent new music machine for the evening ball. Well, I promise I will try and stop by. It was awesome to catch up with you guys. Totally. Yeah. This has been great. I am going to see you all again. Same time next week. Thanks again, guys. I'll let you know as soon as I'm done with the revisions. Oh, cool. Can't wait. Axel. I tell ya, I am just the luckiest. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Getting to work with you, hanging out with the Order, and living in the coolest town in the whole world. Beacon Town! Beacon! that some days you'd rather be out adventuring with your friends, but I'm really glad you're our leader. You just make this place awesome. I really do love this place, and it just keeps getting cooler. Right? I love it, too. It's exactly the kind of home I'd always dreamt of having. I know that Petra is waiting for you in the mines, but I bet people would really appreciate you helping set up for the celebration. I'll keep that in mind. Control myself. So, I really love Minecraft Stone Ed. Um, yeah, I, I got that. I really love Minecraft Stone Ed. I watch it all. I mean, I watch people do it all the time. Jesse, dude! I bought it myself. No! I thought you were out seeing the worlds. Did that? Righteous times. Thought I'd try settling down for a while, though? Like, I love danger and daring do as much as the next person. Well, you picked a great spot. Pretty proud of this town. Yeah, dude, it is awesome. Letting everybody be themselves. Super individualistic. House over there that looks like a squid. Righteous. <laughs> yeah, squid. Between you and me, I am worried that I won't, like, fit in here. So many rad builds. Awesome people. I really want to make, like, a good first impression, you know? Which... I thought might be helped if my front yard had a statue by the one and only Jesse. Not sure if I have time, but I'll see what I can do. Hey, hey, hey! Yeah, this, this is, is going to be so statue. cool! The Scoop up that clay out. over there and let's get to business! Yay, this is where I make the statue. Oh, you can't hold the axe. Oh, wow, I see why some of you people think this is hard. Ooh. Ah, uh, a blank canvas. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what I'm exactly making. I just know it's kind of like a combo right now. Maybe I'll make a present. Ooh, smart. That's decent. for Titus. Yup. That's how you do it. Now this will be on you. Everyone will love it. It cannot get destroyed. It must have longer. Reasonable. Yes, it's that. That is some sweet work. Uh, nice. Yeah. Oh, Jesse, dude, thanks. It was my pleasure. Well, it is an honor, mi amigo, and don't be a stranger, okay? Well, she is a fascinating woman, isn't she? Very free spirited. <laughs> yeah, kind of reminds me of Petra back in her early days. Speaking of whom, you said she's waiting for me at the... Mineshaft! Mm-hmm. I want to go say hi to Cassie. And Stampy. Whoa! Oh, Wink! Get back here! Leave Jesse alone! Hello there, Jesse! I was wondering when we'd run into each other. Thought we'd give this town of yours a try. It's quite lovely. Yeah, and I can't believe how many people are here. Well, it's so great to see you. We need to hang out. That sounds wonderful. Yeah, totally. Radar, this is Stacy Plays and Stampy Cat. Oh, Wink. Here, Jesse. Give him a bone and he'll calm right down. Here, Wink. Nice tasty bone. Aw, see? He likes you. Uh, yeah. You want the rest of these back? Nah, hang on to them. I've got tons. You never know when you're going to need to tame a wolf. Well, thanks. I imagine you're terribly busy, so we won't keep you. But you should come and see what we're working on, because it's pretty cool. Yeah, what Stampy said. Anyway, our place is by the gate. Will do. See you guys later. Well, that was fun. Okay, wait, I just want to see what is this. The sword, the, yeah. Okay, can't do anything. <gasps> oh, I must look at ribbons. If you guys don't know, Minecraft's story mode is, well. Best pig that ever lived. I miss you, buddy. You saw the, oh, the man. Dog. I wish I could have met Ruben. He yeah. sounded amazing. I read Lucas's book the other day. That chapter about Reuben almost got me crying right there. He was a hero. He saved everybody. He'd be really excited about how great Beacon Town is now. I bet that's totally true. Oh my gosh, it's you! Oh, yep, it's me. What are, what are you doing here? Oh wow, this is actually perfect. For founding day this year, we're picking a pig to play the part of Reuben on the float. Oh, that's really cute. Right? Oh. Would you be interested in maybe helping me pick? I mean, who knows Reuben better than Jesse, right? Yeah. Talk about knowledgeable casting. I would love to. It seems like the least I could do. Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you so much. All right, let's see him. Okay, piggies. Show Jesse your good side. That's Esteban. 
Smushy Q Cheeks, and Lord Von Thunderpork the Sixth. <laughs> Tried my best to bring the pigs that felt the most Moobin-esque. Hmm? You're all adorable. Definitely Esteban. He's got the most intelligent face. Really? Ah, I knew that's who you'd choose. Fantastic. Congratulations. <clears throat> Thank you, Jesse. I'm going to get him ready, and I'll see you at the celebration. Bye. Well, if you guys, um, at the beginning, it showed, like, what happened before. Um, Ruben is a hero. He's Jesse's best friend, and I guess I'm Jesse, so am I. Oh, I'm, I might just ditch her. Yeah. Where's the mine? The bouncy guy. The bouncy guy's over there. Oh, I would love to go to the bouncy guy. Lost. I should go back. Hope Ivor and Harper are having fun out there in the portal network. Can't wait to hear about it when they get back. Those were the days. Simpler times. Yeah, simpler times. That was the statue that made us win a competition. Oh, let me go to the... There's the Withers um, thing. The Withers one. Bouncy guy, bouncy guy. Oh, I want I just want to see the bouncy. Bouncy, bouncy. Jesse! Oh, hey, hey! Look who it is! Jesse! Hey! Hey guys, what are you doing? Glad you asked. We're working on a new game for Founding Day that I guarantee you is gonna be all the rage this year. Slime diving. Oh. Wanna give us a hand finishing it up? I'll let you take the first dive. Bob designed the schematic. Sounds Ninja Bob. Great. That I'm sounds down. awesome. I'm Let's down. do it. We're going to be I'm diving sorry. off this excellent pagoda Bob designed, but we can't decide what material to use. Thoughts? I know. I'm just conflicted Ow. because I like all of them. Oh, we know you do, Bob, but don't Let's worry. Jesse. Nothing prettier than pink wool. Let's get to it. Nice, that turned out great. And just like I promised, you can take the first dive. Yes. Just aim for the slime. It'll be great. Go, Jesse! Woohoo! Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Woo Ta-da! Thanks, everyone. Jesse, that was incredible. Seriously, amazing dive. Thank you for that. Thank you for the help before. No problem. Look, my friend's waiting, so I gotta run, but nice work. Mm, that's okay. Now, what's the matter with them now? Chickens? Get egg. Uh, excuse me. Ma'am, thank you. I got him. 
Okay, there's this one YouTuber who makes these hot things in all the videos. Huh. What a lovely garden. Now, if they ever make a Minecraft story mode, season three, I want to be in it. And here we are at the mines. Time to meet Petra. Nice. Thanks for walking with me. Oh, no. Thank you, Jesse. It was a pleasure watching you work. It truly was. Stopping to help all those people. Helping them prepare for founding day. Very inspiring. I'm ready to go down I'll, and see uh, Petra. Keep watch on things here while you're gone. Off doing your adventure things. Risking your life. Got all the faith in the world, buddy. You got this. Thanks, Jesse. I won't let you down. I really like Radar. Bye! Well, Have a good time! Comments. Don't I always? This was so worth the money. Petra? Huh, I swear she said to meet right here. Petra! Where are you? Oh, stupid zombie. Oh, I got a sword. Oh, I miss this. <coughs> oh, smell not so much. Look at that. Punctual and kicking butt. Nice. Hey to you too, Petra. <laughs> hey, glad to see you remember how to use your sword. I was worried you'd gotten rusty. I can't even imagine that life. Managing people, signing papers. Ugh. I really do miss this. You know, us adventuring together, facing the unknown. Wish we could do this more often. Except I'm gonna have a hard time being seen with someone wearing such dingy armor. What is that? Iron? I didn't want to dent the good stuff, so what? And look who's talking with an iron sword. Where's your fancy gold one with all the enchantments? Can't remember the last time I saw you without it. I, uh... Ready for more? Ha <laughs> <laughs> Too slow, zombies! Typical. my step yet. Well, you sure showed me. I will say, I really appreciate you making it on time. It means a lot to me. I sometimes worry you don't have time for your friends anymore. I know you enjoy your job or whatever. Not that I'm trying to make you feel guilty or anything. Oh, come on. You know you're more important to me than all of them. Okay, now you're just trying to flatter me. But, uh, can't help but know... Okay, one thing. Um, this is not the end. But, um, well, um, I'm really good at fighting in Minecraft story mode, I guess. Oh, I was really good in Minecraft story mode, season one. But that, that, it's just because I've played Minecraft story mode many times, but I've never recorded it. Th and usually I just rent the game. This time I actually bought the game. So now I'm doing all the seasons. I mean, see uh, all the episodes. Because on Minecraft um, Story Mode Season 1, I never finished it because I only rented it for like a week. No. L like less than a week. Maybe a day. So we're like, now that I have this forever. Yeah. I've only played Minecraft Story Mode Season 1. And. I'm really good at fighting in this, I guess, just because I've played a lot in this, but I'm not good at fighting in Minecraft. I suck at Minecraft.
notice that we're missing one, two, three. Axel has boomtown duties. Olivia's grading something or other in Redstonia, and Lucas is writing. I figured, man, our friends have gotten lame. I swear, if our old fans saw what we're doing now, I'm just saying, I don't care how good Lucas's next book is, it's not exactly slaying a wither storm, you know? Hey, don't get bummed. Even without them, we're having fun, right? Yeah, that's a good point. At least we've got the cool people here. We'll worry about them later, I guess. We gotta hurry. What exactly are we looking for down here? I'll tell you when we find it. Just trust me, it's important. What was that? Come on, let's race! Wait, what? It's monster hunting time! And now I control it, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, it's Jesse. What's up? Good to see ya. <laughs> oh, perfect. I'm starving. <laughs> uh. Well, what was I supposed to do? Everyone get down! It's gonna blow! Where'd you go? Where'd what go? Ha! Look down there! So you're really not gonna tell me what we're chasing? Nope. Mysteries will make makes it fun! Come on! Keep pressing space to jump. But it because uh. it's See him. to save you, Petra. Seal them off Why somehow. Is she red? Like, maybe a little lava. Why is she red? Is she like dead? Ah! Whew, that totally did the trick. Ah, see ya. Hey, no fair. That wasn't fair. So why was she red? Oh yeah! In your face! Petra! Petra! You're number one! You're number one! Uh, cheater, much? I totally saved you back there. Oh, oh, yeah. You're right. Sorry. I shouldn't be gloating. I was just excited. Okay, this mystery better live up to all the hype. 
Here I come, mystery monster. So happy to see you. Wait, let me get this straight. This quest was just to track down a stupid llama? It's not just a stupid llama. It's, uh, it's important, okay? It's apparently like, uh, treasure-sniffing llama, or, uh, it's important, okay? Please, just trust me. We just need to bring her back to her owner. It doesn't need to be, like, a thing. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. If you say it's important, then I trust you. Yeah? Yeah. Now, how about we get you out of here, huh? Come here, llama. Come on. Come on! <laughs> That's what you get for wearing that dork armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just have to craft a new set. Dang. Let's get this thing. Don't let it get away. Just grab the... <laughs> 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 Gross! Get speeded! Oh, let's get after that armor-wrecking thing. Uh, hang on, it's super dark down there. We should make a torch. I know how to make a torch, I'm not a knob. I'm not just gonna make one torch. No, we all probably gonna make one torch. We just make one torch, it's supposed to be four. Here, llama, llama, llama. Where'd you go? After you, Mayor Jesse. Told Yay. you I'm not the mayor, I'm the- Leader and hero in residence. I know, I know. It's just that you do a lot of paperwork and like town running things. Could you stop? Call a shovel. It gave me three instead of four torches. What is, it? Uh, okay. Call a shovel, am I right? What the heck did you get up there? Who knows? There's something behind <laughs> What the? What is that? I know what it is, but I'm just gonna act like I don't know. This. I wonder what this uh, is. Get out of the way, I was looking at that. What's that? Only one way to find out. I have no clue what that is. Oh, I keep forgetting. What was that creepy whisper? Uh, I didn't hear anything. Some sort of glove or gauntlet? Looks like it's made out of prismarine. A prismarine? But you only find that at the bottom of the ocean. Whoa! Uh, how did... Where? What is the... 
this thing. I don't know. I, I don't know. It, it, it seems like it's not hurting you, and that's good. It looks kind of... Okay, actually, it looks really cool. Uh, which I know might not be what you want to hear right now. Petra, gotta tell you, I am freaking out here. It's gonna be okay. It'll be okay. We'll figure it out. Ah. Well, uh, here. I'll help you take it off. Okay. Ow. Wow. Stop. That thing is really stuck. I just can't shake this feeling that maybe you were meant to find that gauntlet. Like, maybe it was your destiny or something. Man, what are the odds? Command blocks, portal keys, why is it always me? I don't know, but there's definitely a pattern. Uh-oh, get off the pyramid, quick! We're ending it off right there. There. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Part 2 will be released probably in like 6 hours after this is released. And yeah, see you guys later. Bye!